friends welcome in our own teacher channel class 10th science chapter number 2 life processes in living organisms part 1 workshop number 2 hello friends lesson number 2 life processes in living organisms part 1 in the workshop first we have seen from question number 1 to question number 5b now in the workshop 2 we will see the remaining questions so let's start question 5c with the help of suitable diagrams explain the five stages of process 1 of meiosis Process 1 of meiosis is longer and more complex as compared to meiotic process and is subdivided into five phases. 1 during the leptotene stage compaction of chromosomes occurs and chromosomes become more visible. 2 during zygotene stage pairing of homologous chromosomes occurs this is accompanied by bivalent or tetrad formation 3 in the pakana stage recombination for example exchange of genetic material take place between non sister chromatids of homologous chromosomes 4 during diplotene stage the bivalent separates from each other except at the site of crossovers phi u during diakinesis chromosomes are completely condensed and assembly of meiotic spindle occurs the nucleus and nuclear envelope start disappearing d how all the life processes contribute to the growth and development of the body various life processes like nutrition digestion respiration excretion circulation and control and coordination are essential for the growth and development of the body nutrition is the process through which essential nutrients like carbohydrates proteins fat vitamins minerals are taken up by the body for proper functioning of the cells digestion is the process of breakdown of food into simpler and absorbable substances respiration is a process by which food stuffs are oxidized either in presence or absence of oxygen releasing energy in the form of atp excretion is one of the important life process in living organisms because it removes harmful metabolic waste from the body of an organism in humans transportation of oxygen nutrients hormones and other substances are carried out by a well defined a circulatory system living organisms show different type of movements such movements require proper coordination in humans control and coordination is carried out by nervous system and endocrine system cell division can also be considered as an important property of all living cells by which new unicellular organisms are form e explain the krebs cycle with reaction krebs cycle is the second step of aerobic respiration it occurs in the mitochondria two molecules of acetyl coenzyme a produced from pyruvic acid which form by glycosis enter the mitochondria the acetyl group of this molecule is completely oxidized 
through the cyclic process. The products formed during the Krebs cycle are carbon dioxide, coenzyme A, ATP, NADH2 and FADH2. Next reaction of Krebs cycle. Acetyl coenzyme A plus 3 NAD positive plus FAD plus GDP plus PI plus 3 H2O. After reaction 2 CO2 plus coenzyme A plus 3 in bracket NADH plus H positive plus FADH2 plus GDP. During Krebs cycle, NAD is converted to form NADH2, FAD is converted to form FADH2 and GDP is converted into GTP. Friends, remember ATP, adenosine triphosphate, FADH2 means flavin adenine dinucleotide. NADH2 means nicotinamide adenine dinucleotide. Question 5. How energy is formed from oxidation of carbohydrates, fats and proteins? Correct the diagram given below. Carbohydrates are used as the first source of energy and oxidation of carbohydrates like glucose, ATP, NADH2 and water in conditions of insufficient carbohydrates like fasting and hunger lipids and proteins are used for energy production lipids are converted to fatty acids and proteins are broken down into amino acids these simpler molecules are then converted into acetyl coenzyme a acetyl group of acetyl coenzyme a is completely oxidized in the mitochondria through the Krebs cycle to produce CO2, NADH2, FADH2 and coenzyme A. The correct diagram of the process of energy production through aerobic respiration of carbohydrates, proteins and fats is as shown. ATP NADH2 and FADH2 are the energy rich molecules synthesized during Krebs cycle. Friends, we will take now some extra question answers. What are the various systems of the human body? The various systems of the human body are the digestive, respiratory, circulatory, excretory, reproductive and nervous system. Two, what are the main sources of energy in the human body? Carbohydrates, fats and lipids are the main sources of energy in the human body. 3. What is the difference between body level and cellular level of respiration? In the respiration occurring at body level, oxygen and carbon dioxide are exchanged between the body and surroundings, whereas during cellular respiration foodstuffs are oxidized with or without oxygen. 4. What is cell division? Cell division is the property of cells of living organisms due to which a new organism is formed from an existing one or a multicellular organism grows up. For you, what is Fermentation. Fermentation is the process of conversion of pyruvic acid into organic acids 
और अल्कोहल्स बाय एन एरोबिक रिस्पायरेशन सिक्स वॉट इज द इम्पॉर्टेंस ऑफ बैलेंस डाइट फॉर बॉडी बैलेंस डाइट हेल्प्स इन प्रॉपर ग्रोथ ऑफ बॉडी इट इंक्रीजेस इम्यून सिस्टम टू फाइट डिसीज इट इंक्रीजेस कैपेसिटी ऑफ वर्क बाय प्रोवाइडिंग एनर्जी इट इज इसेंशियल फॉर गुड फिजिकल एंड मेंटल हेल्थ वी स्वीट ड्यूरिंग समर एंड हैवी एक्सरसाइज वाई ड्यूरिंग समर एंड एक्सरसाइज आवर बॉडी टेम्परेचर राइजेस आवर बॉडी मेंटेन्स इट्स टेम्परेचर बाय स्वीटिंग द स्वीट इन टर्स इवेपोरेट्स एंड कीप्स आवर बॉडी कूल सो फ्रेंड्स थैंक्स एंड बाय